Hi there, in this video I will demonstrate how to pay your best com bill online using your credit card, debit card or net banking options. First open up your web browser and enter bestcom.co.in in the address bar. Once the page loads you can find the blinking text saying online payment. This is the quick payment mode so click on the online payment button. You will be redirected to the quick payment form. Here you will have to enter the 10 digit account ID mentioned on the bill. So I enter my 10 digit account ID. If you do not know how to find your account ID, you can click on this link which says how to find out your account ID. Please click here. Click it. This is highlighted in the red box which is right under the RR number. It is a 10 digit account ID okay I know my account ID I enter the account ID here six eight enter the CAPTCHA code and click continue On the next screen, you will find four options that is payable, ASD, ISD and MSD. ASD, ISD, MSD are all deposit amounts which need not be paid regularly and which has to be paid only once in a year. So now we select payable, re-verify your account ID, the name as mentioned on the electricity bill, the premise address and the current balance. Match it up with that amount in the bill. If everything is fine, the due date. If everything is fine, select the checkbox. I have read and agreed the terms and conditions for online payment and click on make payment. You will give you will be given two options. One is bill desk payment gateway and another is IDBI bank. In this video I will use bill desk since it provides a neat payment receipt at the end of the transaction this is my personal preference I select bill desk and click on pay now click OK enter the email address to which you would like a email receipt from Bescom and then click continue you will have different payment options credit card debit card internet banking re-verify your merchant name and the payment amount enter the card number enter the expiry date enter the CVV code enter the card holder name as mentioned on the card and click make payment you will be redirected to the Citibank authentication since mine is a Citibank credit card also you can note a 1% transaction charge added to this amount since I'm using a credit card it's a 1% transaction amount click on IPIN enter the IPIN for your credit card then click next once the authentication is completed you will be redirected to the payment receipt which says transaction successful the transaction ID reference number the account ID email address and the transaction amount you can print the receipt that's all guys thank you see you in the next video